death. Awesome. <laughs> I thought it might be nice to have a bit of girl time together. You can't touch me. Of course we can. No respect. In all our lives, there's a fall from innocence. A time after which we are never the same. It happened in the summer of 1959. A long time ago. Oh, man! Where do you hear this? Where do you hear this? What is it, man? You guys want to go see a dead body? When the night has come and the land is dark. We interrupt to bring you an update on the search for the missing 12-year-old Ray Brower. Kid's gone. They're never going to find him. Not where they're looking. And the moon. Never mind that she is the hired gun of an ultra-liberal political action committee. And never mind that his 12-year-old daughter is sleeping down the hall. Lucy, are you okay with this? My having dinner with a lady? Dad, it's cool. Just go for it. and I'm running for president. In the past seven weeks, 59% of the country has begun to question your family values. This poll doesn't talk about my presidency. The government of Israel does not negotiate with terrorists. But they'll have to do something. Nothing can save those people. Nothing whatsoever. Suppose they let the children go? Right at this moment, the rest of the world is with us. Don't touch anything. We go all the way. To observe and stay out of the line of fire, that job left them with a distinguished reputation. Watch a pro. Police are under arrest! <laughs> Well, that's how a pro does it, huh? Now, they're about to face... <laughs> ah, don't you dare sit in my chairs. ...the biggest challenge of their careers. Gentlemen, this assignment is confidential. The U.S. Department of Justice asked us to help find a witness. Stay out. We heard you're good at it. We think you'll be able to pass for father and son. No way. Hot, but I just stop it, right? Piranha hunt in packs. The first bite draws blood. Blood. Draws the pack. Everybody out! Three hundred and thirteen pounds. Let me see that. I would imagine that's fully clothed. Oh my god! How oh, she could be the house! This is disgusting. I hate this job. Two undercover cops on the trail of an escaped killer, staking out the house of his unsuspecting girlfriend. I think she's gone on a diet. Everything was routine. Lucy, you got some explaining to do. <laughs> Until one of them stepped out of line. I was supposed to be watching the house, right? So I was watching the house from the inside. What do you want? I just want to know that it's it's really happening. We recently had a close encounter. A close encounter with something very unusual. Here than born on the back of the old fellow himself. Do you feel that? Something's off.
safe. Someone wants me. Someone roaming the streets wants me. And I bet you're smart enough to get us some brew. A ballpoint pen, a pint of old Harper. Okay, you got an ID for the liquor? Not until I left it in the car. You'll have to get it before. Oh, well, I, I also, I forgot the car. We're finally getting out of this turkey town. You just can't stay 17 forever. You can be whoever you want. As far as I'm concerned, you're Douglas Fairbanks. Who? Douglas Fairbanks. Wrong! I'm John Dillard! You know, all my life I want to be a bank robber. Now this happened, I guess I'm just about the best bank robber they ever had. Interrogation techniques utilize fear scenarios. You mean like pulling out their toenails? <laughs> Try it, old man. Take us away. Three feet of water, about ten feet from the beach. Yeah. What we are dealing with here is a perfect engine, uh, an eating machine. We're not only going to have to close the beach, we're going to have to hire somebody to kill the shark. Bad fish. But I'll catch him and kill him. Did you hear your father? This shark, swallow you whole. You're going to need a bigger boat. That's a 20 footer. 25. Three tons of them. Hurry up, he's coming straight for us. Don't screw it up now. Don't wait for me.